right, today we're gonna set up this this lock, if you guys can see it. Now this is also a digital clock, all right, numeric lock with an actual fingerprint and they include keys in case you get yourself locked out. So if you forget the passcode, there's ways to reset the passcode, there's ways to come into the system. We're gonna set it up on a on the door here as a mock-up so you guys can see how it works um they give you a templates if you don't have the cutouts properly they give you the templates here so you could cut it out yourself they give you the proper tools including the keys and they give you actually uh phillips if you guys can see that everything's mocked up ready to go we're going to take a look at it and see what we do uh, on top of that the instructions are included so let's get it going all right, this is the wrong way to do it. We're gonna show you how to put it. This has to be facing down, all right? And there is an up, all right? So don't be confused about this. So once you see, you can even see the up right here and this dimension here, right here, it tells you right there. So let's go ahead and set it up. You gotta make sure you put the long screws to hold the- The metal piece here. The metal clip that goes into the door make sure to put the plate the metal plate yep. all right so if you forget your code and you have your keys it still works works with the without if you guys can see it now we're gonna set it up with the code all right and the default password code is one two three four five six all right here it goes we unlocked it we're gonna and then you could just lock the key if you guys can see it I have it locked right now so if I put my fingerprint now that I program it it unlocks it very simple easy to use i could come back in there right now i can't lock it but i have i would have to lock it from inside once again lock it in fingerprint you guys can see very simple we're going to unlock it with the default code one two three four five six pound i believe and it unlocks it that's the code that we have default when you get out of the box make sure you guys change that all right there's a way to do it. The instructions are very thorough. It tells you exactly how to change it. You gotta go as administrator to change it. So right now, again, we're gonna go ahead and lock it. So we got our fingerprint already scanned in there. Unlock it, very simple. We're gonna lock it up again. We're gonna do the default. One, two, three, four, five, six. And then pound, and it unlocks it. Very simple, easy to set up. You have to replace the batteries when the battery starts low. When the indication that it's low, the lights gonna start blinking here. You're gonna see a blinking light when it starts getting low. Now, if you ever forget your code or your fingerprint's not working, you always could always unlock the door and lock it with the actual key. Very simple, easy to use. I hope you guys enjoy the video. 99.6 of you are not subscribers in my channel. I hope that the content helps you out and that you find it very useful. And I hope you hit the like and subscribe.